favorite show. It's Let's Get Retorted. My background just changed. All right. This is Let's Get Retorted, a part of the Working Perspectives podcast. On this show, we're reading different comments that are left on our social media and YouTube channel, and we're responding to those comments in kind. First comment. We got some more hate for our girl, boys. Arabella Del Busso what? is back oh on the gosh, show. Oh, my gosh, dude. I know. I know. It's seriously I know, impressive. I know, I know. It is, it I'm is. seriously impressed. I yeah. agree. Oh! Let's go! How does, she, how does she hit the algorithm, right? Um. So what happened was this comment he came doesn't. off. I don't know how she does it. This comment came off the uh, shorts clip that we have of her, of her talking about a rough story of her growing up. And the comment comes from Ada Martinez, 2445. Uh -huh. They have 1,000 1, subscribers off of 293 videos. Oh, damn. It's so a content it, creator. Yeah, Ada, you hearing this, come on and talk about it, right? Ada, so I do up, believe man? I failed you. Yeah, so Ada Martinez, <laughs> if you want to come on and talk about it, we'd love to see. She just wrote, what a liar. What? That's it. Uh, a liar. Calling our girl a liar. <laughs> With yeah. no context. I'm like, man. Yeah. What a liar. I asked, I asked her, I was like, really? How so? No response. So... If you want to come on here and let us know what you're really thinking, please do. But if not, then uh, go shove up your shove and then shove a little more. You know what I mean? Yeah. Know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. Know what I mean? Know what I mean? So. Come on. All right. I do have another announcement to make. This is episode 50 of Let's Get Retorted, boys. I mean, can you believe we've made it this far? Two weeks away from one year of retorting all over everybody's freaking face. Great, great stuff. So, uh, the 50 50. And we're live yeah. watching the Sixers play in tournament. This is fantastic for everyone. Yep. Fantastic. Yeah. So, next comment comes off of the butt chuck with the Zin clip that we <laughs> came out last week. Uh, it's from M O S Z. I guess Mose is how you say it. Mom. It's from E D U B. N W. <laughs> Go ahead. Sorry. He loves no, it. I don't know. E D U B N W. Matt didn't e get the joke. E Dub yeah. puts drugs in his butt. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Our buddy <laughs> also went rectal. All right. Good for him. Hey. Wreck him. I damn near killed him. <laughs> Wreck him. <laughs> so I said to him. Wreck him. <laughs> Uh, so either way, uh, in the it's the clip about people putting zins in their in their keisters and their foreskins. Um, so, dude, do you put drugs in your foreskin? I haven't. You're the only I, one who can. I, I yeah, fucking man. want put to. like M and M's in there, like trail mix. Oh just man, I want to put some drugs in my. The one bull on Stern used to they used to have a game because he was on certain <laughs> Sal, What's in Sal's pouch? pouch? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He used to put M and M's in there, and they count like, them. He got like twelve M and M's in his pouch the one time. God, yeah, Matt, Matt we're not utilizing your pouch. Stuff? That would be yeah, like Matt, the we best need to use your spot ant eater. Yeah, you could fit so many oxys in your pouch. Yeah, hell yeah. Oh, <laughs> Throw a couple of eighties in there and get on a plane. You know what I mean? Oh, we're good to go. Dude. <laughs> I would love to put some oxygen. My elephant there. trunk ate them, officer. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they're all melted. Hey, what am I responsible <laughs> for that thing? It's got a mind of its own. <laughs> all right. So, yeah. The next, the Hot comment top shows from... up and his head pops out and they shoot out. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like a pest like, dispenser. So, uh, Mo says, well, the best way to prevent infections would be make sure they're sterile. Soaking in rectified spirit should take care of that, right? Question mark. How's he? Uh, what's it, what? All right, let's I'll go. It. From Mose, he says. Well, the so this is about sticking zins in your butt. He says. Well, the best way to prevent infections would be to make sure they're sterile. Uh, soaking in rec rectified spirits should take care of that, right? Oh, he's a jokester himself. 
I admire it. Spirits. I like Get it, it yeah. rectified. I see <laughs> what you did there, my friend. <laughs> All right, next hey, comment. Hey, hey. Next comment comes from Sticky Fox. Sticky Fox. I, said, I don't like that Sticky. name when you're commenting on wieners. Stick, Sticky Sticky Fox. 153 subscribers off of 20 videos. There we go. Sticky dickity. Stick dickity lick splickity slick. What? Okay. Uh he he left a comment on the butt chug with the Zen clip. Uh and he just put it's uh it's Z Y N. I was putting Z I N. So I'm the asshole. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, you are. Well, Sticky not technically because you didn't put any Zins in your butthole, <laughs> but I hear you. Yeah. We can make you the asshole. You we're gonna draw a straw, see who has to put a zin in their butt. I mean, I don't think we'd have to draw long because I know I'd do it. Uh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'd, I'd do anything to feel something, guys. Let me tell yeah. you. <laughs> Just to feel light. <laughs> I'd do anything to feel alive again. Uh, okay. Let's keep it moving. I, I've been thinking about this more and more. Dude, gas station drugs are out of control. Like, there's yep. a full wall section at the gas station yep. by my house. Yeah. And I don't know what – they have mushrooms now. Like, it has, like, a picture of mushrooms on it. They have Delta 8, Delta 9, gummies. I don't know what any of this shit is. And I'm about to just have a, a gas station drug party one day. They got Dude. Rhino 6,000, Rhino, Rhino 9, pills, uh, yeah. mushroom Horny pills, Delta weed. 8. <laughs> yeah, just throw it all on a table, mix Bro, it in like a pregnancy that, punch, and just have a wild-ass gas station is, drug party. They got yeah, stackers in there. snake oil. Is it though? Oh, yeah. I, I mean, well, to be fair, I don't know. I know horny goat weed isn't. That shit works, baby. It <laughs> <really does. laughs> Scabo. Uh okay. Either way, next comment. Since That's it's uh episode yep. Ever, ever since it even though it's episode fifty, I want to show a little love to some of our favorite retorts. So uh next comment comes on last week's episode, episode three hundred and forty. Uh, it's from our favorite Ozzy, aka Ooh. Alloy One One Zero Zero, aka Miss Metal, uh, aka Sue Matthews. She just says, "Top show, guys." Dot dot dot. Love it. Dot dot. Heart emoji. Love you. Had a girl. The best. Thank you. The uh, best. N- the best. Next comment from Miss Metal comes on the uh, vasectomy during an earthquake clip. She says, <laughs> "I wouldn't go to a mobile vasectomy clinic anyway. If yeah. the van, <laughs> it says, if the vans are rocking, don't come a knocking." Amen. <laughs> hey, Amen. Hey, Love you. And then she. I then, need the a next... vasectomy, but I need it within fifteen minutes. <laughs> yeah. Is I there something wrong? Dude, what is with the mobile di- vasectomy, yeah, dude? I can't real. wrap my head around. Yeah. I'm a very busy <laughs> businessman. I don't have time to go in an office. Is there a mobile yeah. option? Like in Temple, where they have like all the lunch trucks lined Ooh, up cards, and everything. Yeah. <laughs> well, it's just like the vasectomy thing. You imagine yeah. making that phone call? I'm like, yeah. Uh, so I take my lunch at like 11:45. <laughs> you you can pull up in the parking okay. lot. I guess I'll get my hose. I need my window, uh, my windshield replaced in my car, and I also need a vasectomy. Can we do that in the same parking lot at the same time? Uh, so okay, next comment comes off of the NFL star gets uh, road rage with your boy Slugs. Yep. Uh, and Miss Metal just wrote slugs, dot, 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 L-M-A-O, <laughs> crying face emoji. <laughs> Fucking Justin with slugs. Uh, you Ooh, said his name. Terrifying. You said slugs probably 10 times in that It clip. was awesome. He got it right one time at the very one end. Time. Think, <laughs> but I think he accidentally got it right. Like, he was he was meaning to say slugs. <laughs> yeah. I think he and was again, like, damn, is it slugs? Eh, who knows? Dog, while we were taping Close that, enough. the second I heard him say it the first time, I was like, did I just fucking hear that? And then yeah. I'm watching it go, and I'm like, oh, my God, I don't say anything, don't say anything, don't say anything. And then without even words, I already see Matt's face when it clicks. That you're... <laughs> I, started I was dying. like, uh... <laughs> I'm a mush like... mouth retard, and this is the news. We're all mush mouth retards. <laughs> nice. Um, next comment comes off of the Eclipse idiots asking why do their eyes hurt. It says, <laughs> LOL, she said, Miss Metal says, LOL, at school we had we had to hold a piece of cardboard up with a hole in it, turn our backs to the eclipse, and watch it on a wall. <laughs> <laughs> we also funny. had to hide under our desk when a nuclear bomb was coming. 
Yep. Uh, Miss Mel then left a comment on the butt chug with a Zin clip. She says, oh, no, the things people do. Crying face emoji. Uh, she left another comment on the uh, worst two people ever clip. And she says, ah, oh, those poor dogs. I mean, the one dog's having a good time. Uh, and then Ma, she left a comment on the Morgan Wallen arrested after throwing furniture in Nashville bar. And she says, the furniture didn't like his songs. <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> that is great. I love I seen the video. Though. You see the video of the cop carrying it into the bar? I was cracking up. Like, you see the guy that it said it yeah. landed somewhat near? And he's, yeah. like, walking it back into the bar, and the one leg's all smashed the fuck under because it yeah. just fell from 70 feet. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I did want to read this comment, too, from Miss Metal. It comes off of episode 338, uh, the one about trouble at tool time. She says, I loved Home Improvement or just JTT, but still dot, dot, dot. Watched it all the time growing up. Would not mind seeing a remake. My heart is broken. I hope they end up filing charges against the driver. Poor puppy. R.I.P. Uh, about time, Oregon. And then she says, I still stand and blame the parents. 100%. Great episode, guys. I just wanted to give uh, uh, Vermont Mom a shout because I want to shout out some of our favorite retorts that we've had, especially reoccurring retorts like Miss Metal, mm -hmm. Sherry Cola, Vermont Mom. I mean, I can't believe almost a year ago we talked about Vermont Mom talking about her fucking stepdad on the show, Miss Metal throwing in some fucking heaters, and then Sherry Cola's mom passing away. Like, all that shit happened within the span of the last year on this show, which is wild to me. So... I mean, you know, that was the last comment. I just want to say thank you to everyone that's been commenting, liking, sharing, subscribing these videos. They have been growing week by week. And, you know, we just can't thank you enough. Steve, what do you got before we get out of here? I'm happy you came to me right away because I got I, it just came off the top of my mind. I don't want to sound weird or nothing. But Miss Metal and Vermont Mom, you both said I feel bad for the dog. And I'm a firm believer. That that dog was living his best life and was not oh, happy God. that they got rid of this weird human who was backing that ass up for the great name. <laughs> oh. Like a weirdo. His dog was just so probably weird. licking his nuts and shit. I don't know. This dog's living <laughs> life as far as I would understand it. So um, I I'm not trying to be weird. I'm just saying. I don't know. I think maybe the dog <laughs> did him a disfavor. The dog said, girl, who you playing with back there? <laughs> He's like, can you imagine talking about He's my dog being woman. happy? My dog used to get happy. That's why I love dogs over cats. Like when you go home, it's tails wagging no matter what. You imagine how happy that dog was to see oh, her when she came bro. home from work. The tails wagging and the whip, the lipsticks the, flapping, man. Yeah, that that red rocky is <laughs> red. out immediately. Yeah. So shout out right. that dog and uh, fifty retortants. Yeah, yeah. Shout out, uh, Le Schmooze. What do you got, baby? Yeah, I would just piggyback off of that. Thank you, everyone, for your continued support and everything. 50 yeah. episodes. It's been a, it's been a very good yeah. time. Yeah, hell and yeah. Keep on and keeping on. It'll just keep, keep getting on. better, you know? Hey, appreciate it. Uh, Justine Richardson? What about, like, a, like a movie like Forrest Gump, but, like, instead of, like, historical, like, popular events, it, he was in, like, all the bad events? Like, he was, like, born at Pearl Harbor, and then he was, like, supposed mm. to be on the plane that hit 9-11, and then, mm. and, like, his kid was enrolled at Sandy Hook, and, like, he was at Wuhan facility when the outbreak, like, a movie like that. Wouldn't that be I'm fun? confused at what the question is. Forrest Gump Dude, part two. Yeah, I'd watch Gumper. it. Would you? I'd watch it. Forrest yeah. Gump. Forrest Gumper. Yeah. It'd be fun. <laughs> yeah. Gump no, I'm Gumper. down. I mean, write it, Justin, and then make some money and then pay your boy. So there Listen, you go. I'm going to be fucking honest. Maybe don't put the kids thing in there. That won't make me sad as shit. Let's leave out the <laughs> Sandy Hook. Spare him that. We'll give him all the That's other wild. shit. You know what? You know what? The, he was on the boat that hit the Francis Scott Key Bridge. <laughs> yeah. He was. He gave he OJ was, uh, cancer. He was going to Virginia Tech when that sniper guy was yeah. there. He was in the bell tower trying to fix the clock. Yeah, he let that guy in that. by accident on his way out. Like, he was the guy that had to help uh, uh, Ray Rice pull that broad from the elevator down the hallway. <laughs> oh, he, he, he trained the Arab <laughs> guys to fly planes but not land them. Oh my god, dude, that's wild. Um, okay, yep. So, speaking of 
I mean, I'm not yet. Uh, this <laughs> Jay Dunn just went in a weird direction. Yeah, this has been another episode of Let's Get Retorted, the part of the Working Perspectives podcast. This has been episode 50 of Let's Get Retorted. So thank you all very much for liking, sharing, subscribing, commenting, and doing everything you've done for us to help support the show. We can't thank you enough. Uh, if you want to, you can check out our stuff on all podcast platforms and YouTube at Working Perspectives Podcast. You can us on Instagram at Working Perspectives Podcast. Join us on Twitter and TikTok at Working Be Pod. If you'd like to be a guest on the show, please email us at workperspectives.gmail.com. Please like and subscribe so we keep bringing this sweet, sweet content. Thanks again, and we love you all. Thanks. See ya. Here they come.